What's up guys, this is James Blonde from OnRPG.com here to show you a quick battle and gameplay footage so you can feel the action. Now it's time to play World of Tanks. Alright guys, I'm using my favorite tank here. This is my also probably my favorite level. It's called Malinovka. And it's just pretty much an open field. This is what your stereotypical tank battle should be. You've got a lot of cover here. You've got your uh, fence fences. You can you can either demolish or hide behind. You got a lot of trees. And there's the enemy base right over there, uh, which I'm going straight for pretty much. You've got water over here and over here, and you can go right around to get to the base. All right, let's do this. I like this tank because it is a lighter tank. You've got um, a lot of upgrades you can do. This is one of the ones that you start off with. As you can see, other people are using it. And um, I think I'm gonna hide in this house for a second, at least, at least until the action starts. And uh, I've upgraded the gun on this one here. And so therefore I can shoot, um, instead of one shot, I shoot bursts. Smaller bullets, but seems to be pretty effective. As, you, as long as you lock onto the target. Okay, so we got somebody right here. As long as you lock onto the target, you're good. Alright, let's see if we can't do this. Ooh, yeah, a little window. Alright. Target acquired. Critical oh yeah, see? I just tear him a new one every time. Look at Enemy that. First tank, down. first kill. Hell yeah. That's how I roll. No, literally, that's how I roll on my tank. Alright. Let's see what we got here. I'm gonna try to find somebody else. Try to give y'all some action going on. Sometimes these battles don't give all the action. Sometimes your teammate is just so good that you don't really get to do much. But I'm trying to do this. Permission to engage. We nailed it bad. We nailed them bad. It's like I hear. We just dinged them. Oh. That's gotta hurt. That's gotta hurt. I like that one. We didn't even scratch them. What the heck? So I got just dinged them. That's gotta hurt, and we didn't Where'd even scratch go? them. Whoa! All those red dots right there. That's all the enemies. Yeah, that's not good. What's, um, I can see that one. They're hard to hit, but this gun is not quite as accurate. But when you hit them, you do pretty good. And the, sometimes their armor just doesn't even affect them. Ooh, looks like one of our artillery guys got him. That's what caused so much damage there. And plus that guy. Um, nobody's shooting at me, which I'm glad. I'm like right out in the open. Uh, I wouldn't recommend doing that. <laughs> Let's see here. I'm gonna hide behind this fence for a second. Sometimes the only problem with this tank is that if you get behind some of these fences, you can't see. I may be able to give you an example of that. Yeah, see? You can't quite see over them. And when you can't see over them, that means that your barrel is not clear for fire. Which is pretty neat. See, have you noticed that the barrel is just slightly going over that? Alright. Back to the action. Let's see if we can't. Ooh, there's a tank right there. So, mini-map is very helpful because you can kind of get an idea of where they are and respect to you. Of course, that's a mini-map. Um, let's see. Got epic tank music going. Looks like we're pretty much kicking their ass. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm gonna go for their base. Like I said, one of the objectives is to go to the their, their base. Just capture the flag style. But uh, this is probably pretty dangerous going out in this middle of the field here where uh, all the other tanks are shooting and firing on me. Uh, only a matter of seconds before I get shot. This guy right here. Target acquired. Another thing I like about this tank is that you can shoot on the go. I'm mean, shooting as Target I'm driving. Lost. I don't know. I didn't kill him, but somebody did. Alright. I'm gonna go to their base. Oh, come on. If I was in a bigger tank, I could have ran over that, but I guess this tank's not big enough. Now I'm just vulnerable. Ah, okay. So we got Mr. Tank over here. Ooh, yeah. No, that's not good. I'm getting shot from somewhere. Ooh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Uh, at least it didn't hurt me much. Your tank is weak, buddy. My tank can handle it. I may be small, but that's not all. Alright. Oh, crap. There's one right over there. 
Ready to fire. Yeah, see, he's out of my range, my barrel range. I'm gonna help out my buddy here, and and that symbol there means he's a medium tank. Uh, you can turn off the symbols if you want to. Ooh. Let's kind of let's see how let's see the rest of the guys go. There's only four of their teammates left. Um, let's switch over to him. Looks like these guys are going to try to capture their base. Look at that guy shooting from a long ways. This gun's accurate. You guys better move around. I noticed that whenever you're in these little areas here, you want to definitely move around because uh, people know you're there and they're going to be shooting at you. Oh, it's close. We've got enemy base captured 42 and friendly 38. So they're capturing our bases, we're capturing ours, or theirs. And uh, we only got two guys in our base, or their base. And uh, oof, it's gonna be close. This is a close game. Close game. Let's see what some of our other guys are doing. Where, where are we at? Okay, we're all, okay, that's good. So when we all, all the teammates get in their base, uh, that means we capture it faster. So we just won just because we had more people in, in their base. Okay guys, thanks for checking out my gameplay footage. For more information about World of Tanks, check out onrpg.com. Catch you out there gamers.